Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials in Hand. In this video tutorial, we are going to see how to write a C program to convert dollar to INR. So without further ado, let's get started with the video. So first of all, at the time of recording this video, the conversion rate is that one dollar is equals to eighty two INR. So we can clearly figure out that we will require one input from the user, and that will be the amount in dollar, and then we'll calculate its equivalent amount in INR, and we'll print it simply. So let's start writing the program. So in any C program, the very first thing that we perform is to include the header files if it will be required in our program. And herein we are going to use printf and scanf. And so the very basic header file is what? It's stdo.h. So let's include it. Now once we are done with that, now let's start writing our program by starting our main method. Now the very first thing that we have to do is what? We have to take input from the user that would be in dollar so let's declare a variable uh, for dollar and let it be of floating type let's say the user wants the equivalent amount to be uh, 3.5 dollar then we will require a floating data type uh, to deal with it right now let's ask the user to enter the amount now let's suppose the user has entered the amount then we as a programmer have to make sure that that particular amount gets stored in this variable dollar right so this thing we can perform easily with help of a function called scanf and this scanf is available in this particular header file which is studio.h now we have to write basically modulus f since the data type is of floating that's why we have given modulus f and where exactly we have to store so we have to store it in the variable dollar so let's write dollar now what what's our next step so our next step is to convert this particular dollar into inr let's declare the variable and let the variable be simply inr now what we are going to do is we are simply going to calculate its equivalent and say that INR is equals to whatever the dollar that the user has entered into 82. So this is the particular amount that we were looking out for. Now let's print up the result. Now let's return zero. Let's run this program to see everything working. And here you can see that it's asking me to enter the amount in dollar let it be one dollar and boom here you can see that the amount in INR is 82 let's try out with a different input let the input be uh, let's say hundred dollar then you we can see that the amount in INR is 8200 so this is how we can write a program in C language to convert dollar to INR I hope you enjoyed the video so this was all about the video thank you